I used to tell you that taking care of yourself is not a luxury. Yeah. I think you believe me. I do now. The, um, I do now. It's going to be a long time since people met the person they should have known every day of their life. Yeah. You know, they didn't get to see who they were seeing. You were taking care of them. And they would have taken care of you differently if they could have seen you differently. What, what I'm wanting you to do is be an example for people who are, who are in the same position. Yeah. If it's been too long since you've done something for yourself, do it. If you think you can't afford it, find a way to afford it. Yeah. If you think you can't take the time, find a way to take the time. Today we're doing a special, kind of a different vlog. A lot of you don't know that at Brighter Image Lab we actually do a lot of um, smile makeovers that we don't charge for. And I think we do probably over 100 a year at least, and sometimes more than that. What we always try to look for is people whose smile is, um, if they had a different smile, they have a different life. Just recently we had a girl who worked for us. Her name's Jill, and she's been with us for a long time. And Jill's got the biggest heart. Man, she's just got the biggest heart you'll ever know. Just super compassionate. Jill's in charge of what we call New Life Smile. We take applications from people who've signed up and told us their story. And when they tell us their story and send us pictures, and she's the one that goes and looks in the pictures and sees if she can get someone to uh, fit in the empty space. What you don't know is that we want to surprise Jill. Jill broke her tooth and it's causing discoloration. Ever since she's cracked it, it's been a big deal for her. She takes care of her teeth. It's just, they don't look like, like I think she wants them to look. And then we heard something bad the other day that made me feel bad. I heard her tell some girl at work that she was on Facebook. And one of the things on Facebook was upload four pictures of when you were really happy. And she said, I couldn't upload any pictures. And I will tell you, Jill's a very happy person. She comes in with a spirit that, that's bigger than the room. She's always real big at making things go really well for us. So what we want to do today is we know we have one more spot for some New Life Smiles. And we want to do one more makeover before the season got going too crazy. And so I'm going to surprise Jill with her own makeover. What I hope to show people by doing um, Jill's surprise makeover is that taking care of yourself is not a luxury. And any of those people that benefit from your help would love the fact that you did enough for yourself to have good energy and, and to feel proud of yourself and, and to bring your best self to every situation. And um, sometimes good people get caught with great intentions and they get caught being putting themselves last. And I'm hoping that what we'll see is that she'll look more powerful and she'll look like she has more energy and it'll bring out her spirit. And I think it'll match her personality. It's who she really is. So follow with me and, and we'll take it from there. Um, let's just see how it goes. Thank you guys. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah, we got to have this girl. I've seen You think you're just doing it for the fun of it. She's got perfect teeth. Yeah, some of them are too bad. And you tend to want to go with someone who's a little younger. That's terrible. Why? I don't know. I think that we've done enough young people. Yeah. Don't you? Yeah, we need some older people. We need older people. We only got one more place to fill. What I want to do is I can't find the person I'm looking for. I want to do yours. Mine? I want to do yours. So if you will, let's just Mine. do yours. We go over all these cases and you're always trying to get these people, you're trying to find their story. And their story's not any better than yours. Wow. Let's just let's just work on you today. Okay. Yeah. These people are not less important to us. But you're not less important to me than these people. Do me a favor, let's just stop and go do it today. Let's just do it right yeah. now. It won't get done. I want to do the full makeover. Okay. Um don't worry about working the rest of the day. Let's just move and do what we normally do if we had someone coming in today. Wow. Work, just work with me, okay? Okay. We'll be fine. But let's just get it done. I'll talk to you when you get done. Okay? Okay.
you said it's been a while. How long? Since I've had like a makeover. Or just, or yeah, how long has it been since you... 1992. Remember when the glamour shots were big? Yeah. Yeah. I had a glamour shot. <laughs> and, then, and then what? Just life takes over? Yeah. Four children. And uh, we had a restaurant and homeschooled and just was too busy. Well, now um, my grandmother... I mean... Four. Four grandbabies. Four grandbabies. Getting big? Uh, three to seven. Three to seven. But I think uh, I think I was like kind of in a rut, I guess. You know, because I'm I'm four years divorced. You know, I'm I'm watching my grandkids, and I'm my parents are aging, and I'm helping there, and I'm working, and and I was always on the back burner, kind of. You know, and I just thought, okay, well, that's it. I not that I'm done; it's over. But like, okay, this is my life. And Okay, I'm good. So a lot of people take care of. Then the days pass. Yeah. And they see that it's been a month. It's been a year. Yeah. I know you work a lot for everybody that you care about. Yeah. But, but there comes a time to where you got to make sure you're not invisible to you, so that people can see you too. Uh-huh. Um, got lost. We did this in a couple of hours. Yeah. What's weird is I've known you for years. Yeah. And we probably wouldn't have known. I don't know if we really knew the value of our work. I don't know if we would have told people, hey, you should try these. You, you helped me do thousands of these. You were kind of surprised that we said, hey, let's do this. Yeah. She would have done your hair, you would have went right back to the same thing. Yeah. Or somebody would have done your makeup, it would have been back the same thing. But if you just take the time to put yourself totally back together, then I think that I'm hoping what you'll be is an example for 100 women that sit in front of the TV every day doing babysitting or doing something that's helping someone else and saying, listen, and whatever's holding you back doesn't have to hold you back. And the number one thing that holds people back is their smile. Yeah. But if you if you do any one thing and you don't do the smile, it doesn't come together. But when you do do the smile, yeah. a lot of those other things aren't necessary anymore. Uh, I'm incredibly shocked at, at how wonderful your smile looks. <laughs> and I... Me too. I think it opens us up to not just the younger crowd. I think there are a million women out there that's going to say, that convinced me that this is for real. It gives me a lot more energy of who we can offer these to. And bringing it all together, it's pretty cool. It just took it. I'm just amazed. I I thought that, okay, no, it would be good, you know? Yeah. But this is like, wow. I'm, I'm it is yeah. What I like is is that I think it's going to make you stronger. I think you're going to do more with good energy. And I think you're going to do what you can to have, you know, four corners of your life. Yeah. Where you're still mom, you're still grandma. And that's good, yeah. Yeah. But the people that need to meet you are going to meet you. And the places you need to go, you're going to feel welcome. Not like you're old or that you've worn down or that yeah. they're not going to accept me. And that anybody in your category is going to be somebody that wants to have you at their table. Yeah. And I think a smile had a whole lot to do with just going, I can look exceptional. I can yeah, look great. Yes. I've been very proud to make this happen. And I thank you so much for, for working with us. And, and then again, I always thank people. It takes a lot for people to show their before and afters. What I'm hoping they'll realize is not only, you, not only they believe that what you're doing, you're doing because you want other people to benefit from it, but that you really care about people being able to get what what could be made available to them that they think is impossible. Yeah. And I can't thank you enough for sharing that with me. And I look forward to showing the people more pictures. Yeah. And I can't wait to see you do, send some pictures of your grandkids and people seeing you be your best you. Yeah. And I'll hear those stories and I'll share it with these people. I'm going to ask anybody on YouTube if they have any comments for Jill to leave the comments and I'll get her to respond. <laughs> huh? Because they're going to have a million questions. (laughs) They're going to have a million questions. Okay. Okay. Yeah. We'll work it out. We'll make it happen. But anyway, so we're going to wrap it up today. (laughs) Thank you so much. And if you have any more questions, please comment. Please subscribe. Please share it. And that will get us done. Thank you more than you know. See you later. Thank you.